Hi guys and welcome back to my channel and if you're new here my name is Hannah Renee and it is so nice to meet you. Today we're going to be doing a dressing like YouTubers video. So for a week I dressed like a YouTuber every single day and I just really love these YouTubers and I love their style so I just thought this would be a fun challenge type video. They're all inspired by the YouTubers. It's not like exact clothes from them, but I try my best. So without further ado, let's just jump right on into this video. On Monday, I dressed like Marla Catherine and Marla Catherine has a really 90s vibe to her. She is very vintage. She doesn't really go along with the trends too much like she does but it's very vintage and old school looking so she always wears turtlenecks with shirts over it and that's why I had to do that so I just have my white turtleneck from Costco my black shirt which is the natives of the Golden Coast shirt is from Brandy Melville my pants are from Target so the Wild Fable brand at Target they're mom jeans and my shoes are just the classic Vans old school type of thing. So I did this outfit on Monday and I personally don't know if I'd wear it again. Like it's not something I wear very commonly, but I thought it was cute for that day. It's also the outfit that I wore if you saw in my 90s transformation video. It's a total 90s outfit to me, but Anyways, I just love Marley Catherine, so that's why I did that outfit on Monday. On Tuesday, I dressed like Ava Jules, and if you don't know who Ava Jules is, she's amazing. She just hit 1 million on YouTube, by the way, so congrats to her, but she's a YouTuber from Hawaii. She's a senior in high school, and I just really love her joy and just her passion and everything, but she mostly dressed in summer clothes because she lives in Hawaii, but I found this outfit that happened to be one of the only winter outfits that she wears. But I'm just wearing this burgundy beanie from H&M. My black shirt is just from PacSun. My jeans are from American Eagle. They're just some high-waisted jeans. And then my shoes, again, are the Vans old school shoes. So I just tried to copy that outfit, took some pictures in it, and this is definitely something I would wear. It's very simple, classic, not too hard to recreate, so. The next day I dressed like Jacqueline Brooke for Wednesday. She's a Christian YouTuber, which is not something you see very often, but I totally love her. She is just the cutest person ever. She's from Tennessee and she's my age. We're like the same age and she's just adorable. So I love her style. It's very modest, which is what I like to dress like as well. So how I recreated her outfit is my turtleneck gray sweater is from Forever 21. The necklace that I have is a Giving Keys necklace. But my jeans are from The Garage, just a Canadian clothing brand if you've ever been there. And my shoes are the Nike Air Max shoes. I don't really know all about that, but they're the ones that I got when I was in Tennessee. So I totally would wear this outfit, except those jeans I ended up throwing away after this video because they're so torn up now. They've really been through a lot and I just need to get jeans that don't look completely trashed, but I just saved them for the video and then I threw them away. So I would totally wear this outfit, just change out the jeans. That's Jacqueline Brooke. For today, Thursday, I dressed like Summer McKean. Obviously, you already know I love Summer McKean. And I recently just got featured on her Instagram, which was really cool because I bought one of her necklaces and then I tagged her on it on my Instagram story and she reposted it. So that was really cool. But I love Summer McKean. She's one of the first YouTubers that I ever started watching. I just love her personality, just her vibe, and her outfits are pretty, sometimes they're pretty out there, like they're pretty hard to recreate, and this is the outfit that I tried to recreate so much, but I really couldn't do it very well. But I have this black beanie from H&M, my choker, I tried to find a little choker like hers, but this is the closest thing that I had to it, it's from Shein. This yellow sweater, I picked this sweater because it has the stripes across the front, and her sweater has that 
I just don't have any sweaters that have the same colors like hers. So I picked this one. It's from American Eagle. And then you can't really see my legs, but my pants are just regular old ladies. So I would wear this outfit. I'm going to wear this outfit today. I definitely would wear this outfit. This is the most wearable outfit that Summer has because most of her outfits are pretty fashion statement type of things. Like not too far out there, but they're not things that I would see regular teenagers wear, I guess, which is fun. That's what makes summer summer. And lastly, for Friday, I just like, you know it, Hannah Maloche. She's one of my absolute faves, and I just wanted to recreate one of her looks. So my shirt is from PacSun, just that yellow and black striped shirt. I wore the same Target Wild Fable mom jeans, and I don't really have any boots like she does. I wish I had black Doc Martens because they would be perfect for this outfit, but I don't. So I just use regular white Converse, the high top ones. And I just recreated her signature pose, which you've always seen her do on her Instagram, which is just pulling her hair up like that. And I just wanted to recreate that. Her style is awesome. It's so cute. It's just everything that she wears is cropped. And I don't really wear a lot of cropped things that show my stomach. I really love her style. I'm inspired by her style, but I would just get everything that she gets longer. <laughs> but anyways, yeah, that's Hannah Maloche's outfit. I absolutely love her. Maybe it's because we have the same name. I don't know, but she's so cute and down to earth. So that's the end of this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, Give it a thumbs up, subscribe to this channel, and let me know of any other video ideas you'd like to see from me because I'd love to do this for you. And that's it. I will see you guys next Saturday. Bye, guys.